before real estate was even on my radar, my wife and I were driving in a very modest neighborhood. We drove past a, a blue Sotheby's sign and, and sort of a, just a normal, modest home. And I asked my wife, I must have talked about it for weeks. I said, who lived in that house? Did Elvis spend the night in that house? Who was conceived in this home that Sotheby's would be a part of this project? Uh, and it always stuck in my mind how that brand made me feel, how seeing that sign and being associated with that made me feel. I began my career actually uh, in business finance, uh, really just the generation of capital. And after doing that for almost a decade, uh, I realized uh, it was pretty dry work, very unrewarding. Early 2000s, that uh, I had a couple of bouts with cancer. Uh, and had me realizing, I think I'm going to make some changes and find something a little more rewarding. I have been in Scottsdale for about 20 years now. I came from California. And we came out for a lot of the same reasons a lot of people relocate out here. Uh, the lifestyle is just amazing. It's year-round sun. Uh, you do endure a little bit of uh, heat in the summertime, but the rest of the year is so beautiful. Uh, and it's the destination for people around the world. I set out on my first day, um, and the first thing I run into was uh, Frank Azami at an open house here in Paradise Valley. Introduced myself, hi, I'm David Smith, um, I'm a new agent, I'm looking for an open house to sit. Frank, as usual, greeted me warmly, said, David, this is your house, sit here as many days as you like, it's yours until you're done with it. Uh, and that was my introduction to Frank, we moved forward, I spent six days a week at that house for three months and then we ended up selling it to a uh, professional wall player. Worked out pretty well. I think the most rewarding part of any real estate experience is, is helping a family find that, find that family home. There's this moment when you show them a home and you can almost see it, it happens almost every time and you can see it, the moment that a buyer falls in love with a home and they sit down and they get comfortable and they start placing their furniture and there's this wave of calm that comes over them like I found it, we've looked and I found it. And that's a very rewarding moment in real estate. Real estate is important to people. It's their most expensive personal assets. It's the home where you raise your family. It's the home where you make all these memories. It's the home where you downsize. And at the end of the day, it's also a great investment. If you're just in real estate for an investment, then you're trying to build generational wealth. And we are happy to be a part of all of those aspects of people's lives. I am uh, happy to be uh, just out in the sun. I do love to be outside. I am a golfer like uh, most other people down here. We enjoy the courses. Uh, I'm a big family man. I'm happy to get outside with my daughter, ride some bikes, go play soccer in the park. We've traveled quite a bit uh, with our new friends, just got back from Spain and Morocco. The kids love to see these sort of things. Uh, we want to show them the world, uh, get them ready for their lives.